Hey guys, I made a video about this the other day and I kind of like the way that I did it, but several people requested me to solve it a different way where I repeatedly square both sides of the equation. I thought it could be cool to see what that looks like, so let's do it. But for the first step, let's square both sides. On this left-hand side, the square and the square root will cancel each other out. And on the right-hand side, I don't really want to do 32 squared, but we can change this 32 into 2 to the 5th. And now to do 2 to the 5th squared, we just multiply the 5 times the 2 to get 2 to the 10. And next, we square both sides of the equation. On this side, the square will go both to the numerator and to the denominator. It's going to look like this. And in the denominator, the square and the square root will cancel each other out. And on the right-hand side, we can multiply these exponents to give us 2 to the 20. And then once again, we're going to square both sides of the equation. This squared can distribute to this term, this term, and this term. It'll look like this. And then x squared squared is x to the fourth. This guy's good. And on the very bottom, this square root and this square will cancel each other out. And then on the right-hand side, we're going to multiply these exponents again to give us 2 to the 40th. And next step, we're going to square both sides of the equation. On the left-hand side, this square will distribute to all four of these terms. It's going to look something like this. This x to the 4th squared will become x to the 8th. The x squared squared is going to become x to the 4th. This will be x squared. And on the very bottom, the square root and the square will cancel each other out. And on the right-hand side, this 40 will multiply by the 2 to give us 2 to the 80th power. And now let's clean up this left-hand side. Let's focus down here. x squared divided by x will simplify to just x. And then x to the 4th divided by x will simplify to x cubed. And then x to the 8th divided by x cubed, we can just subtract 8 minus 3 to give us x to the 5th. And now we have x to the 5th equals 2 to the 80th. We can take the fifth root of both sides. On the left-hand side, we just have x. And on the right-hand side, we can do this 80 divided by 5 to give us 2 to the 16. And 2 to the 16th power is equal to 65,536. And that's the answer to our question. We can put a box around it. If you want to see the first video, I have a link in the description. How exciting.